spent really enough, as much time in Pop Chaka as I did in, love with in on the map, but um, I don't love Sentinels entirely. I'll as I did in Club Penguin. I, oh, you, you know what? I spent a lot of time in Adventure Quest World. But Cypher does Because I played Adventure Quest, which was like the, the single player. But when Adventure so Quest World came out, every single play. time in the computer lab when I was in elementary school, I would play the shit out of Adventure Quest World. And I remember that. First best of three of the day. It's time to get things started, though, everybody. Let's get into our first map of this matchup between version one and cloud nine blue who else do we have for the call other than doug and pot and i played the webkins as well <laughs> i thank you for reminding me of that quite gabby thank you so much potter it's finally time this matchup on paper oh you thank know, you uh se lipsos for the nine. sub what and thank you better, uh zikni for the three months and thank you stealth for the hot um, examples right themselves thank you stealth for the sub oh, yeah. thank you oh, yeah. benny be uw for the sub you know vanity's looking over to his um thank you spicy quality for 14 months thank you uh alchemist for the four months want to make a statement coming out into this series so i i'm expecting drama doug I think IBK oh, shout so out for the interesting the thing is we've talked about this a good bit but, and we've talked about it a lot from Vanity's POV right like Cloud9 got a serious you upgrade what? Vanity I actually didn't play and, you know, Maple Story on a team now he feels more but there but I played oh, I played when Maple Story 2 came out I played that so much that would come for V1 if they were able well, to look at the composition being considered like the behemoths now in Cloud9 we got nuts. That would be nuts. no sky but as uh a KO from these version one and then no sky on the v1 long. side either we're right into it right into the mix here thick of things for the pistol and you can see Zelda's, he's poking around he does why is that mic buzzing you hear that decent damage but Lee, he's so forward so aggressive Mitch tried getting a little bit of it as well. He gets dropped at the hands of Penny, so he'll be traded either way early on. Zeppel's gonna get pushed back as well. But that Molly is really good, by the way. On the way down with the Leaf. Mm. This looking so good for Cloud9. Yeah, Leaf, just, I mean, the timing. We saw the dart coming through in mid. Dude, I... Above the elbow area, but somehow, <laughs> some way, Leaf, he's just so damn slipper. He's able to slip past the dart, get the opening kill through that elbow, and just... The dash. Yeah. Just, I feel like I'm listening to like COD MW2 there. mics right now. Yeah, he does make that. Look These mics are not that good right now. Uh, in a lot of cases, but we're starting to see some of the some of the differences. In how I'm literally in a COD MW2 lobby so right, right now. They they showed that they're very comfortable going very fast in that round. Yeah, and I'll be curious to see what the first gun round looks like. I mean, it I seems think Potter is on a headset mic. Willing to give up this mid area, you saw the pounce, you saw the trap, and when the gun rounds come through, are they going to be just as aggressive? You can see Vanity just popping away some shots through his own smoke. You see Odorous has made his way past Elbow, flirted up with Nest, and dropped the side. Oh, he's going for uh -huh. bar. Uh-oh. Oh, yeah, Zels is good for one on Vanity. And this is a, I mean, this is a pistol, right? For V1, they didn't force up. They don't have additional buys. Good night, that hurts. Yeah, but Zeppa, he's under, a, he's going to be under a lot of pressure here soon. The dart does get him, but luckily for him, Zeta's on a quick flank through among us. Odorous gets another one with a pistol. Kills being traded back and forth. And he lagged out. Able to upgrade a weapon. He lagged out. Wait, what? Okay, thank Mitch ult tabbed. Wait, I think I'm Mitch ult tabbed. <laughs> little, little oh my god. Dude, fucking Mitch ult tabbed. I, I know he did. I know Mitch ult tabbed. I think you are going go for the you know, I just hit Mortal with a lot of poor backseat gaming. I get pressure when it happens. Maybe any tips on how to avoid it or stop it. It's really annoying. Yeah, man. That's, that's one thing that's really annoying. And... Um, the way I dealt with it when I was first playing games is I just ignore, and it's a lot easier said than done, but, um, I don't know, I don't understand why people do that, like, if you're dead, you shouldn't be talking unless you're giving a call out, like, people that backseat, uh, uh, it is really annoying, I think it's soul for the sub, thank you, uh, run ring run for the sub, I think you glow in for the sub. That sort of punishing play, it can really start to stack up. I love, okay, so I, I love the control that Cloud9 are able to apply on Elbow without being there, right? Like, Elbow is such a pivotal part of the map. 
I think Especially at that point, Jimmy thinks something. Think you're officially you ruined from Zeppa, something. Right off spawn, throws the blade onto the elbow wall to control that area without having presence there, which is just a really cool use of utility from the KO. Do you like the Vaxi PA? No yes, really I do. I actually personnel. think it's a good pad. Yeah, absolutely. But the patience coming through for version one here. When, you know, my biggest question was how aggressive. Are they going back A for a hit? Doing the first gun round and. The answer was right there. Very, very aggressive. Yeah. Version one uh, and super you, uh, ready. Sky Azur from some. Only and three members Ophie left. Jr. Vanity's some. got the judge. I mean, it's just, it, it's so on brand for Vanity wrong. to have that judge. <laughs> is there a cage close? The no, Mitch is going to get tagged. Alone. All the members of version Are, one, though, they're Oh, they use the... Site. Wait, that's so smart. Wait, KO S tier. KO S tier. Wait, KO is actually S tier. What the fuck? I was thinking about it. I was like, wait, he's just going to get tagged. And then he throws a knife to take him off the drone. And then throws a pop flash. Wait, that's OP as shit. There's actually nothing to do against the flash now. You don't, you don't hear it anymore. 3v5, uh, the quick trade was right there, version 1 with the Hold up, I need a, I need a, I need a message yeah, Hunter, I need to tell him we're playing KO now. For them to KO be now. able to apply some of that pressure, and we also have to remember the gun situation for Give me, give me a second, give me a second. Less than ideal, and we're seeing some of the implications of that now, right? They just have pistols, they had to buy up a bit more than they normally would have, because of how costly version 1 made the round the second round. So now they're back on nothing there. It's, uh, it's a bit of a welfare buy here. Can't lie to you, Doug. <laughs> there is a bit of armor on the back of Zeppa, and he does have some right. bangs, some flashes. I just let my team know that KO's OP. <laughs> that, that was actually pretty insane what they did, though. But version 1, they're just being so patient. They know exactly yeah. what kind of advantages they have into this round. They've got all the time in the world, a full minute still left. And they're going to utilize I think it's Addy for the sub. Looks like they will eventually rotate back towards A. We've seen a couple of instances now where Odorous is playing mid map somewhere, right? Cutting off rotation. Oh, here. Here. I, no, I was just saying that. I actually don't know, but um, what what C9 actually did there with the KO was really smart. By doors. Yeah, that was actually really now, smart what they did. I've never seen KO used like that, so I get the timing. actually a smart I get the way to use it. I, I feel like KO makes the game simpler the though, where you can kind of. Just for a second, no, but Mitch is classic. You can is kind of turn the game into more like gunfights if he uses his utility enough. right. And if you pop his ulti, it basically just straight up duels. Like either you, you pop ulti, give up sight, or you pop ulti and then you just expect to just fight with no util. Coming through for him, huge. He didn't get any kills and he barely got contact, but that's so much information. Just his cam staying idle and just seeing everything in 4K is giving version one the appropriate rotations to, to take that A site. I mean, it was fully clear, not a single defender in it. Wait, why do you updraft? You can literally, you can literally take the zip line. With that, this time investing the drone through elbow to try to clear out some of that space. But you're you're right. I think the name of the game so far, Potter, has been V1's patience. What's more important, Util or Aim? Um, yeah. Util is pretty important in this game, especially in the current meta, Sky Sova. Util is very very important, and it's actually really hard to even utilize your aim when an, like an enemy plays really good with their Util. It's hard to take favorable fights. This may just be noise. Yeah. Basically, yeah, that's true. You, you still just, so you have to aim less. Util makes the game easier for you. So we see this aggressive attack by Perswall as Leaf dancing around the Util's gonna have to. Get out of my way! It's gonna be a big hit. Just some misdirections. Yeah. Like, wait, wait, there's a flash faster too. I didn't know that. Solva's about to get contact. Mitch does throw a jiggle. The drone tag and Penny finds the opening. Penny was good for one. But Leaf and Zeta, and he's good for another one as well. The Blade Storm continues to cause problems. Effie's is gonna get the spike down. It's not just the Blade Storm, it's the op that does it as well for Penny as he's gotten three on the uh, round. That's all he's gonna get. If he just stayed alive there, that would've been really good. Zeppa, excuse me, cleans him I mean, he, he got three, he was feeling it. As members of Cloud9 it's like a hindsight thing. Just on the other side of the pillar, spotted the shoulder, give them away. Whippy drops as well, Leaf for three and the defuse. Cloud9 take the lead again. 
What a retake coming through from Cloud9. Leaf just right in the nick of time, perfectly reacting off his teammate's contact there. And that was a tough scenario. I mean, the piece in which version good. 1 just I don't think KO is bad. Um, I just so feel like map control, people so don't know how to utilize them as of right now. Here for Cloud9. Same thing as like Sky. People didn't know how to use like Sky, and then Sky just felt kind of bad. But now people are kind of getting the idea, and it feels like a Sova V2. Being able to cut off rotations, but they handled that super well. To be able to have the room to make it back towards B, retake the site the way that they did was just beautiful. And we see, yeah, it's a decent buy across the board. I mean, Vanity and Zeppa. Both are bringing Spectres into the fold, but other than that, you've got Leaf with the Nop, you've got Rifles in the hands of Zeta and Mitch. Yeah, Leaf is going to feel pretty confident holding this deep angle. You know, we're not seeing any sky on this entire map on Breeze. This guy just, just drone through the vents? very common uh, yeah. for this map, no so way, for Leaf, run. he's got to be feeling pretty good with the lack of flashes coming his way. Effie's investing the Hunter Fury. Zeta gets one. Here the null command has been used as well. Oh! Oh, Zels is in such a good spot, not able to land the shots, but did they not know? Oh my did god! Not, did not what the Zelsus fuck? Is now he's just getting tagged up. Odor is good for one. Zeppa, Zeppa, oh, baby Zeppa with the Spectre. Able to get one. It's just two that remain on the side of version one now, but two might be all they need. No, Mitch has shown up just in the nick of time to leave Penny all on his own, so he's gonna get cleaned up as well. I think nice he can do it for to give Cloud9 a two round lead. Absolutely crispy, and I just gotta shout out Zeppa. I mean, he only got the one kill in this entire defense, but the utility, the jiggles, the tucking, staying alive. I mean, he was just such a nuisance on the timing when version one were actually trying to scale into the site that they gotta respect Zeppa. So so he buys enough yep. time, the rotations come through, and not only that, it provides Leaf ample time to just pop I think more FPS Galaxy for some. You know, the more Leaf has time, you know he's good for it, and, and they absolutely right. shut down that A hit. But Zeppa is not from the, the, the Korean team. Back Zeta is. Leaf, a chance at FE Dude, so many teams have confusing player Ooh, names. Zeppa, Zeta, Baby Bay, Baby J. Uh-oh. Played with fire as well, but it was Penny who wins that duel with the Sheriff. It's a lighter buy on the side of version one. Numbers down for Cloud9 again. Deja vu, Doug. Once again, Kennedy uh, going sniffing Gallia, around and he gets Gallia, absolutely Gallia. punished for it. Version one last time around were not able to convert this thrifty. This time, they're just going to hit the B site. The neural thrift coming through, giving them exactly the ki kind of information they were looking for. And Sova's dart is up in eight seconds. So that's exactly when these Cloud9 guys are going to try to come through with the retake. Hunter Fury to delay the plan, at least for the time being. But the Did he get tagged? Up. No, they he have didn't. full control. They've got everything that they want in front of them. You gotta look, the members of Cloud9 haven't even really made it onto site proper. Now they're starting to move forward, slowly but surely. But what util do they have to get in? They have a shot dart. They have a, a bit of mobility. Ooh, whatever ult is rough, oh, man. That's it, Zippa. Wait, nobody's looking on this side. The fuck? They may not need kills. They can just win out the gun duels. Like they have at least up until this point. Whippy playing a cheeky little corner, spots the gun barrel, good for one. Whippy can trade it out though, as the Viper pick goes down. There's just one left, it's Mitch alone in a 1v3. I think your ball time 11 for the sub. One, Penny drops, but that's it. V1, get to three. That Viper ultimate coming in so key here in this round. And no matter what version one, no matter what happened in the site, in this post plant, they had Effies on the long flank, the long game coming into this round. And that was always the kind of insurance plan that these guys had. So beautiful stuff coming through for a thrifty. And this time around, they're rewarded for it. And it really, Potter, to what you were mentioning earlier, it really kind of came off of the backs of the opening that they found yeah. with uh, Vanity dying early in the round towards B, right? Because after that, there was no one else there. Yeah, punishing stuff, punishing stuff. And I'm glad to see that version 1 are able to capitalize off these sort of small mistakes coming through. They're absolutely going to need that. And Penny, oh, he's my gosh. Beautiful information coming through from the Silva tag. And the dart does go through. It pings. Dude, that flash is so strong. What? Flash. 
But Effie, she's in there, man. He's going in. Dude, you can't really react to that. If he threw that a little bit better, though, 100%, he just gets a kill right there. But no audio cue? If you didn't know, your visual reaction time is... Um, I don't know if I'm going to say a lot, but it is slower than your auditory reaction time. So, reacting with your eyes is a lot harder than reacting with your ears. I think he, Adam sees him for the... Potter, Who's your worst agent in your opinion? Potter, easily. So far, to get us at 4 4 early on, we talked about this. We had this conversation off camera. Why are V1 picking Breeze, mm. right? Like, they haven't played, mind you, they haven't played many officials at all recently, but for Cloud9, they're a 5 0 record since I, I believe since August or you, July. You know, on Breeze, like, this is no, that's this cap. Is I'll literally, I'll show you. V1 showing that, hey, they can hang here too. Yeah, absolutely, and and that's kind of a statement, right? To be able to come back out. But like, trust me, and, it and you react faster. Say, hey, okay, it is ironic because yeah, light is faster so than sound, like but um, and you can see that they've got that go button. When you're ready, gaming, right? mm -hmm. sometimes you know, like your monitor isn't like super super fast as compared to like. And I don't explain it. Like your headset is more real time than your monitor. If you know what I mean? It's different on a computer. Like like the, the, it's even though light is faster than sound, it's different on a computer. Yeah, and the spike was down just now. Like like there's a delay on a monitor. But Effie's able to kind of snake his way through the elbow. Mitch, he's got all the information, but Effie's is playing this so slow. He's just given time for his teammates to potentially gather that spike up. Oh, the timing here, Doug. Oh, no. You're right. The timing was brutal. They had a great setup there, but Effie drops. Now the middle half is online. Zelsis is going to fall before the info's even gathered. Isaiah just swings on him, knocks him out, just leaving Odorous alone. Odorous was in a great spot. He was up by Nest. He had all the info. Oh, the auditory oh, yeah, 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 okay. Someone, but, someone linked the actual you know, like fucking like study. Wasn't able to make <laughs> the auditory it stimulus reaches the cortex faster than the visual stimulus. The auditory reaction oh, time is faster than the visual reaction. Time. There it is. Me. That was actually just like a clothesline coming out there it of is. Zeta. A quick peek, and Zels is just deleting. I just know that you react faster than the sound. Uh, I'm not a scientist. I, I'm not. I don't know the specifics. I just know it's way easier to react off sound for a flashbang than it is auditory. Because first off, when you're when you're looking away from a flash too, you have to like see it. You have to register that's a flash, and then you have to look away. Whether like let's say you're playing against Yoru. Whoa, Where his flash, you can react fully off now. of auditory because it one. makes a really loud screeching noise. Penny, we'll see what else he's able to do with that. It seemed like initially it was a push towards B. You hear the Hunter series coming out as well. Zeppa drops. Leaf looking to work the middle of the map. As if he tries to land some damage. Look at this. If he was actually making this a lot closer boot, than you'd expect. As Odor drops, numbers advantage in favor of Cloud9. Oh, once Page again, three. Cloud9 with this A main aggression. Version one, they at this point their options are just diminishing faster and faster into this round. They do decide to come back towards mid here, and there's a timing in which they could go through the doors, but Vanity, he's quick to the trigger. Yeah, Effie's drops there at the end. Cloud nine. All right, I'll, I'll show you. I'll show you guys the like me doing reaction time tests. Like I, I have time. I'll do it. It's in this weird spot i'll show you me doing your reaction type tests with it's my visuals and then with my uh, my ears kind of and, dying, and i'll show you how much right? faster we my ears are than my eyes that they've shown Jeez, and how it hasn't always panned out but Potter, or how works, how much faster really i react off my does. ears than my I eyes mean, it, it really looks like they're just scrimming right i mean we yeah. sure we mm -hmm. saw vanity getting punished a couple times and what can you have sense i have a c922 so huge that you do want players that are going to be willing to kind of sniff up maybe overstay their welcome just a little bit and the perfect yeah. agent for that is leaf and we're seeing that towards a main this time around it was towards mid and, and he kind of swapped with mid i think so you're not fps for the a three months area but yeah it's just cloud Nine, very much I think he's slippery, slippery the nips for the 13 months. And, and the and for micro adjustment. I feel like I struggle a lot long range. Started, um, version one were very patient. They, they almost expect. I would say for micro adjustments, you have to be really comfortable with your grip, and you just have to be really like calm and like. Grouped up hits that version uh, one have been doing, it hasn't been working. 
quite as think low. about it from the enemy's position so, so like let's say you're adjust? if you're, V1, you're taking a shot on them they have to do the exact same thing back to you and a lot of the time it's not whether who's more faster at it but rather who's more precise so you can actually once again right i mean we saw that you can slow things down a lot more and you don't have to react as fast more than like you can be more precise with it fuck man i'm so bad with uh explaining i'm really bad with explaining certain stuff but a lurker towards among us and one player just holding that full kick vanity and just making that jet not have uh, the freest op shots uh in the world so definitely maybe something like that but as i say that you can see once again version one are very much grouped up together very Probably well explained yeah i'm oh there you go through. Through. They are um on i'm really bad at explaining so stuff it, it but you just have to be really calm patient hey, here's a, a bit of an and you have a lot more time to react than you think in the previous round it was vanity who had the op was beat this time it's mitch yeah like if you take your time and you're precise a lot of the time the enemy will not take his time and it will be inaccurate. The ways that they're willing to play around instead of having a, an opper, a specific opper, hold an area of the map and then move on, on different rounds, they have that much confidence in each other that, like, anybody can do it. Uh, I think, yeah, uh, uh, uh Perch for the sub, for Slime Fade for the sub, uh, uh, James Six for the sub. Yep. Depending on, on your spawn and, and, and where you I'm on the artisan here, you know. Very first moments, but I like the luxury. Leaf, How long will be shooting for? I'm just going to be watching this series and then I'm going to head out going back towards that B, but nobody's moving for Cloud9 at all. They're holding their ground, no one's biting, but everyone's grouped up towards B. It's a free sight here, Doug. Well, you've got, I wonder if the op has an angle. Out for Vanity, there it is. Wait, yeah, Vanity's opping on Viper? Else, now Leaf is gonna be on this pinch. Oh, the left. spike should be able to go down. Well, it depends on what Vanity is gonna be able to do with it. FE manages to get the spike down. Numbers advantage in favor of Cloud9. We talked about the op in the hands of Vanity. We also need to touch on Leaf and his slow but steady movement towards B. If he gets the timing just right, he's gonna be able to blow this up as well. Cloud9 attempting a retake from a number of oh, this is here. This is fucked for which is certainly gonna divide the attention, divide the focus of the members of V1 that are playing on the site. Leaf. Looking to be the tip of the spear. Vanity is moving his way forward as well. Leaf spot's been given away, but do they swing oh, off of that? Where's the swing? It doesn't matter. Leaf's good for one. Leaf's good for oh, two. Leaf's Nathan. good for three, baby. Is they're gonna get the defuse as well? What a retake from Cloud9. What a retake indeed. And you touched on it, right, Doug? The fact that Leaf, the jet, was on that slow flank. You could see the cog wheels turning. You could see that Cloud9, mm. the communications were coming through. Who's gonna get first contact? Leaf gets that sort of first opening, does a lot of damage. And, uh, the jet kit once again it has to be set doug it's just it's so damn good what are their pings dude was just i think too, and, and isn't c9 like in texas right now been a, a part of the game plan i'm pretty sure board, i think v1's right? in illinois of, uh, or if you will and i actually don't know we're gonna run wait no v1's in texas it may work it may not are they both in texas and it, we're not gonna change and now look at they've got a i think they're both in texas potter in zeta and mitch's hands really anyone unless he nines in la man I, I don't know i know v1's yeah, in texas that's, pretty that's sure scary. i mean one of the biggest debates on this map is is the viper wall enough and if you've got two operators holding these long lines they're double hopping on the sova enough. and so we'll see what mitch oh that was so close cipher. he does what? take a little bit of shock dark, shock dark damage and cypher that's a freebie oh. This is different right now. <laughs> this is actually different. What the fuck's going on? No, it's the Hunter's Fury that cleans him up. As they all just drop, they drop instantly. Potter, a flawless round going on. Seeing I know something we don't. We got we got the the silver op with the the cipher op, and then I saw the viper op earlier, and I saw the jet op, and it just kind of happened. Oh, you could see version one were so. I don't want to say nervous, but they. I'm I'm going to quickly show you guys my reaction time between my visual and my audio story, okay? So I'll I'll do visual first and then after I'll show you um auditory. Okay. But this uh, so this will be a reaction time test, so I'm going to go to the perception um so detection is the normal reaction time test, okay? Um so I react fully off of what I see. You still there?
So this is reaction time test for anybody wondering. So I got, I have a 154. Uh, oh, you can't even see. Yeah. So I, I have a 154 millisecond reaction time. And if we go look at my, my ears, so perception, we're going audio detection. I'm just going to bump it up a little bit. Just so I hear better. Fuck was that? Oh, wait, why did I see a ball? Right, I reacted off my sub sound. I reacted off my sub sound. Don't worry about that. What is that ball? What is that ball? What is that? I'm closing my eyes for this one, by the way. No. Oops. Feels weird closing my eyes. I have a 136. Okay, that that was a that was an auditory reaction time. So, don't mind my false alarm. I I clicked on my sub. Uh, thank you, Hobbernaut, for the two months. But I have a one fifty. What I have a one fifty four millisecond response uh, reaction time. Um, through visually. But this is I'm on a three sixty hertz monitor, by the way. So, it's a little bit faster than what you normally see. But um, for your ears, it doesn't really matter what hertz you have. If you have sixty hertz, if you have 144 if you have 240 if you have 360 it won't matter for your ears but mainly like your 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 ears you react faster off your ears than you do for your eyes even though light travels faster than sound drops Dude, what? The man is on one right now. Yeah, he's already gotten two in this pistol. So, Chris, just thriving in the chaos. Now, Zell says he does have a little bit of space here, but Cloud9, the crossfires, the angles, there's just so many things that Zelsus has to clear. Vanity right up next to his wall. And these version one guys, they've got to get some incredible shots off to make this retake happen. Well, that's one incredible shot. But the Zelsis has oh. more. No, the Utah is just too much, man. The shot darts. Look, he's got to look everywhere. He's able to get a second one, but that's it. He gets one for his troubles. Oh, uh, okay. my bad. is not able to convert much more than that. And Potter, I think you nailed it, right? Like, there was so much that they had to deal with there. The crossfire was oppressive. The utility that they had there was suffocating. There was nothing that V1 could do. Yeah, I mean, unless maybe Zelsis had a button on his mouth to raise his sensitivity up and he's doing 180s, one tapping everyone <laughs> left and right. But otherwise, yeah, Cloud9, they were perfectly set up in this post plan. And I mean, you just look at how the round started, right? Leaf. What's so your smell quick, reaction so time? That's a good question. Never tested it. I thought you said PC case monitors are bad. I do think I they're mean, bad. I don't think they're as good as play for version one. They can't afford to let those go by like that. I'm just waiting for Zowie to make a three secure smarter. And that's perfect. He takes aggressive positioning. We'll see what they do with it though. On the side of version one, you've got two marshals. We've seen how devastating that weapon can be on, in general, but particularly on this map. It seems to light up kill feats more often than not. We'll see if Zelsis and Penny have any success with it. I like the doubled up towards Zelbo or Emo rather, but the drone does spot it out and <laughs> Cloudman are being very patient, very cautious. I like that. It's a nice change of pace oh, from what we've been seeing. Oh, that 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 classic at some points is the best gun in the game, and then in other moments it does things like that. 
not able to get much out with that. His version one are just down to two members remaining. Still has that Marshall. Zelsis does. But Van, it is um, I think you need to show you, uh, Yurei for the sub. About to say a little old teammate action, but no, Zelsis gets one with that Marshall that we mentioned. See if he's able to get anything more with this. The spike has been planted. So it's not I think just the four for the two months. Cloud nine that he has to worry about. It's the Play clock as well. Then. Mitch cleans him up. Odorous is left alone. Oh, I Did you look up to any players when you were starter? starter? Um, I liked watching Shroud yeah, and I, I liked he Pith. Might have considered it, but I'm sure his teammates were communicating over to him that they are all I think he, for the sub. surviving. So he definitely yep, wanted to yep. kind of ruin their money a little bit. But either way, it's not a bad oh, round nice. for version one. Not only did they get two kills, but every single member on Cloud Nine are gonna have to rebuy their armor. So, all things considered, it's a dub. Wasn't Pith on NID? He, he was uh, on Nip at they one point, yeah. This round count. Now, what we've seen so far yeah. in this half, is I I watched Pith when he was on LG uh, kind of back in from the first half. Oof, long time ago. What is this cam? Area. And once again, the Sheesh. Cam. Wait, where is that? A lot of information. Yeah, and it's, what this is that is cam? I've never seen right. that in my life. You, you were just touching on how Leaf normally posts up by pillar. Truly, you clear out the box, right? No, I guess not. I guess you don't. Zelsis gets one on the Leaf. His Leaf thought he had saved him the drone as the tip of the spear, but Zelsis swings out and is able to get away with his life. Zelsis gets a second one as well. That rain is coming online. It may be a problem here, Potter. Cypher diff. Odorous does win out that duel, and that's huge for version one. They are able to somehow, some way, hold down this A site. It's only out of ammo. Vanity's got the marshal in his hands. That drone, though, they gotta do something about it. Vanity does get tagged, and he's gonna have to fall back. It's all up to Zeta now. I think it, Johnny O Potato oh, has been spotted as well. So was just caught. So was just causing serious problems. I think he fuzzy crayfish. Seventy six percent. Oh, Zeta I don't know about that. Seems to be able to do a bit of his own as well. The thing is, they both have Wait. seventy health and no armor. He tried the dropping the vandal or the bomb too much. Have weapons. Oh, they do have rifles. This is doable. This is just so difficult. The nice left. thing is, you have time. Oh my God. Flip the map. You, you're gonna have to bust the move here. You ain't got that much time. Oh, Wait, is he flanking? Looks like he's gonna go back up towards Among Us here. They just cut noise. Huh. But <laughs> he's going to Among Us. At all, and Zeta gets wiped out, looking the wrong way. Whippy's good for it. I don't know about the door player. Only six seconds left, and yeah, he's just he's bailing out. He's I think if he back. went bridge, that would have been big brain. But door. Version one. Yep. And and we touched on it in the round, but. Effie's oh, no. the... mm. <laughs> and he was a nuisance up until the very end. That's a cool pistol. Right? Like we touched on the drone, we touched on the recon dart, and then for him to get a kill at the very end, Effie's was just just like a gnat that refused to go away. Yeah. Oh Dust man, it's just down. it's such a feels bad when when you've survived the entire round. And I, I mean, <laughs> we look at Vanity's money. I don't even know if they wanted to bait with the Among Us. What gun is he gonna be able to get? Okay, so what? he has a sheriff, no armor, while the rest of his team has purchased. They had 15 ah, seconds. You know, Vanity, I think he dropped. He's a good in-game leader. He's dropped a vandal. You know, what, this is this is what I feel like Kale's really strong at making the game really simple. You drone, you throw the KO knife, and they can't do anything. You want the big brain play this? Wait for them to res the KO and ping the KO's body. Of Cloud9 Blue Zeta just playing on the other Oh, side. the gun barrel! The gun odor has got a little too froggy. Oh, and a great flash. Oh, my Zeta God. Gets two. Zeppa gets one. Cloud9 gets to 11. Holy moly. The things that happened in this round. First of all, Zeppa <laughs> peaked the angle as he's popping his ultimate. So even though he gets one tap, he's, he's able to stay alive and get the res off. That KO flash is deadly, dude. Ult. I mean, Cloud9, they just brute forced their way in. It wasn't really anything special, nothing tactically uh, advanced. Yep. It, they just, they uh, just think brute forced he, uh, it out for the sub, Tiki Zebra Piss for the sub. Well, and like, that's the initiator meta, right? Like, that's KO. That's what he's built for, is to just be able to do that. Yeah, they're, dude, they're just sending it with the KO. The There's nothing you can do against exactly it. Exactly what Cloud9 dial up and... Literally just throw the dagger and then just five man. You literally can five man with no issue because you don't get stopped by like Cypher Util or anything like that. 
Uh, thank you, Gregson, for the five dollars. I play with it on Ultra. And all three members of version one, I mean, they're just kind of funneled towards the mid. Mitch, she's got so much information. The kill flash Holy comes through shit. and he gets a spam as well. And that's just like, a, that's a, sometimes things are just falling your way, right? Like in a spam like that through the door, and I believe it was a headshot specifically. I think time ain't space for some. kind of going cloud on its way. Uh, right now, as Whippy and Zelsus are the only two that remain, you see they're just currently not in a position to make an attempt at this site at all. Somebody else saw Leaf right click his daggers at the wall. Point. Um, Potter, did he pop them early in the round? Was it, so a reason why you might... Right? Okay, so, let's say he didn't accidentally click it. One is just one, one if he popped it at the beginning of the round, round and then he noticed that they were already going to win the round, you yeah, right click to reset the knives. So either if you die hunting, you get a orb, or if you get another kill, you get an orb. Like they're scrimming out here, right? And yeah. you gotta demand the respect in the server. And right now, version one, they haven't been able to. They've they've had a couple rounds of brilliance, but otherwise, Cloud Nine. Uh, thank you, Starkey Gaming, for the sub and thank you, Time Eight Space, for the sub. Area, it's if it's not Leaf, it's been Mitch. If it's not Mitch, then it's Zeta. I, I mean, at all points. These Cloud9 guys are just getting in the face of version 1, so even though version 1 are getting into the site... Are you using a different set of skates for your I'm using the Tiger Arc ones. Even possible. Yep. We'll see what they dial up here. Backs against the ropes. Odorous has the only one, has the only ult on the side of version 1 and has a marshal to work with as well. For Cloud9, heavy lean towards A. You've got a bit of a split. Work mid-map, just like we saw in the previous round. Like, like this is a bit of rinse and repeat, Potter. Yeah, and Zeltus is somehow still alive. Wait, how is he, he living right damage, there? But he gets taken out immediately, and these are some good trades coming up oh from my version gosh. 1. A lot of damage on Leaf, he's barely just limping. Vanity full HP here. Oh, that's a beautiful Ooh. shot. He doesn't get the kill, though. Penny just down to 25 HP, still has that Marshall. Here. Spike ticking away. Version 1 are gonna have to bust the move here for Cloud9. Oh. If you can buy enough time, You've got a chance at Oh, it's over. He's doing his vanity. He gets two. Whippy trades him out. Oh, unless they just heard leave. Four HP. Do you have the heroics against Whippy here? Tap. Whippy beat. Oh. Not patient enough. Attack on a just the wrong time. Cloud nine. Blue thinks the 13th to five. Yeah. C9 mopped to be one right there. Wait, who's paying?